So how did uh, your whole family get involved with uh, robotics? Well, I think it all started with uh, my son when he was in about the fifth grade, um, the Lego Mindstorms. He entered science fair and yeah. he designed something that he called Forest and it ran around in a little circle and he was very excited to win a first place ribbon. And mm -hmm. then he went on to just build and build. And from then on, um, it was his dad that mm -hmm. got him started building um, with the uh, Robonova. Okay. And they put that together and they decided, golly, it can't do this and it can't do this. Right. And I want it to do this. And mm -hmm. so they basically, his dad challenged him and told him to get to work. And so that started him thinking about it. And uh, I knew from then on that they were going to be close to home uh -huh. because uh, they worked in conjunction with each other. Sure. And uh, it just, it's become a very fun family type thing. Mm -hmm. We've now gotten uh, everything down in our basement, a little workshop area down there, and uh, I basically throw food down there or call them up <laughs> because uh, that's where they spend most of their time. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I enjoy it. I do enjoy it. Um, I competed once just for the fun of it. Sure. And um, if I continue, I want to get back into the programming part of it. Um, okay. I used to program, and uh -huh. I've just stepped completely away from it. I think I was a little intimidated mm -hmm. by them, but um, I realized it's something that I could do. Uh -huh. And uh, I'm planning on retiring from my part-time job, and I think I need some um, something to fill some empty time, and I know that I'm going to go farther in um, feral robotics. Oh, great. Great. So you've seen a positive effect on your son and your... Uh... I have. I have. It, um, the father-son bond is something that you couldn't pay money for. Mm -hmm. um, it's just developed naturally. Mm -hmm. They um, complement each other. They mm -hmm. challenge each other. Mm -hmm. um, they have so much fun together that that is such a key thing, I think, in, in your life. Mm -hmm. You have to find something that you like. And if you can find it with somebody that you um, should like and you just do like, right. that just kind of puts the um, icing on the cake. That's fantastic. Yeah. Would you recommend it for anybody? I mean, for girls, for women, for... Uh... Oh, definitely. Um, I see uh, just here at the, at the games, you see girls competing, and mm -hmm. uh, you don't see a lot yet. But they are so inquisitive. And I think their attention to detail, I think we could see some real advances because I think mm -hmm. girls have a um, different perspective on it and I think with uh, their focus um, we could see some new changes and maybe some new directions so I would really encourage girls to participate. Super. Thank you very much. You're welcome.